It's the moment many Minnesotans have been waiting for. We were hoping, you know, for the best, and we got great news today. Minnesota State Fair officials giving the green light to the great Minnesota get-together, mask-free with no capacity limits. It's a relief for vendors like Stephanie Olson and her husband, owners of the Blue Moon Dine-In Theater, a State Fair staple for the last 30 years, an opportunity to make up for lost time and revenue. It's income for our family. You know, it's employment. As weird as it sounds, it's a time for us to all get together. I mean, it's kind of like Thanksgiving or Christmas. We all get to work together. Sarah Hayden, owner of Sarah's Tipsy Pie, says it's going to be a race to the finish line now that the fair is a go. I figured it would probably happen at some capacity. So we did already start. I got all the blueberry done so far because that's the big one. Cramming what's typically a year's worth of preparation. Scheduling, hiring, cleaning, you know trials and tribulations of trying to come up with a new food into just two and a half months we wouldn't do it if we didn't love it part of that prep will also involve new approaches to safety protocols we do have plexiglass for our cashiers we're going to run longer shifts with fewer people so there's not so much traffic in and out you know if we all can do a little bit to be safer it's all going to add up adding up to something we all can look forward to i think it's going to be really a big great year devon roming CARE 11 NEWS. Well, since there's no longer a State Fair Police Department, security is still being negotiated between the Ramsey County Sheriff's Department and the County Board. They plan to meet later this month to finalize plans.